Yeah, man. I mean, it, five to one. If he said it's Dominicans up there, I mean, the, no, listen, the, the, man, Dominicans, don't, Dominicans don't do that. Oh, get the fuck! Dominicans do everything sons do, man. Dominicans yeah. are very sunny, man. They got sun blood. In fact, depending on the Dominican, this might be a son. <laughs> Dominicans are Haitians that speak Spanish. Yeah, they're, they're like, remember, they're the island. They share the island with Haiti, man. They're, they're, they're on one side and Haiti's on the other side. The they were also one of the last slave ports in the world. Yeah. Investigation is underway in Lawrence after a deadly shooting at a house party where a gunman killed one guest and wounded five others. The DA has just identified the dead man as 18-year-old Desiderio Arias. Uh -oh. Desiderio Arias. <laughs> uh oh, you might be right. What I say, man? What's that? What's that? Burritos on the board, man. So burritos, burritos. <laughs> you got to get you a. On Brito's one man. DA has just identified the dead man as 18-year-old Desiderio Arias. The shots erupted mm -hmm. at about three this morning at an apartment on Royal Street. WBZ's Paul Burton spent the day in Lawrence. A violent night in Lawrence leaves five people injured and one dead after a shooting during a house party on Royal Street. He was on the ground, so I could see that his leg was bleeding and there was blood on his shoe, but I couldn't tell that he was shot. Investigators say it happened around 3 a.m. at this apartment building. Neighbors say they heard several gunshots. Yeah, like 10. Still bad. We are really scared because I had kids. I got all the medicine. Two years old. Yeah, they wouldn't have no blacks over here shooting shit up, man. They don't. They don't play that. They don't play with sons. Fox no. Fox no. And they be having a little drug shit going on in their little little area too. They ain't gonna have nobody fucking making it hot and shit. Yeah, they, they don't play around with sons. They ain't gonna make nobody else make it hot. Yeah, you. you Imagine might... having to share an island with Haiti. <laughs> like fuck, man. Make you tough though, right? You'll be some tough people, man. They, it's, it's... With, with hey, only like a four the, uh, foot chain a, link fence separating man. the two countries. Yeah. It's one it's one island with a with imaginary fucking line in the middle of the shit, man. Yeah, man, that's a rough that's a that's a rough these people these people um yeah they 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 got cause that border you gotta you gotta hold your border down, man. Yeah, man, these people these people yeah, tough. You know, I, like that one a lot tighter than North Korea, I would think. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah. They'll stay the fuck over there. We are really scared because I had kids. I got uh, a two years old nephew, which is up there, and then uh, uh, we don't know what's going on on the street sometimes. Neighbors say they woke up to police going door to door. Well, they knocked on my door. Well, I'll tell you, man. If I heard anything. Yeah. Well, tell you, police say all six people were rushed to Lawrence General Hospital. One of them, whose name was not released, did not survive. Two of the other victims were taken by med flight to Boston hospitals. Dario Perez has lived here since 2008 and has seen the neighborhood change over the years. This would be a really nice, um, quiet neighborhood for a while. But uh, lately, uh, people moving from different places, from different states, coming in this area. It's like a going Dominican crazy. big pussy from The Sopranos. Yeah, what's going on with that fucking eyebrows? Holy shit. But that man, should scare the crime out of the fucking neighborhood. He says he said people coming from other states, man, and and, and so that means no, that no, the problem, the problem is that they move they move into a neighborhood. Nah, and first nah. first through, most a lot of Dominicans are just re regular hardworking people, but then it becomes purely Dominican and it's game over. Yeah, not, you got a lot not, of you not over here, man. It's, it's mostly like you got a lot of static conservatives, like in Massachusetts. You, you got a lot of static on your um some something just happened to your mic where it's like you you getting like a, a little feedback on your mic. You gotta check your mic. I'm good now. Yeah, you better yeah, 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 yeah. You better, you better okay. now, yeah. Korea has been going crazy. It had to stop. It had to stop. Neighbors also say they've seen a lot of suspicious activity happening out of this building, but nothing like this. It's gotten to the point where many residents no longer feel safe. Every other weekend, the people always come out of the like, eye green and stuff like that. It's usually normal, but it's just when people get out of control. Because there's no difference between Lawrence, Methuen, and Andover, and there's more people with 
do drugs over here than over there. Mm -hmm. So there has to be more police activity. It's, it's just, you know, a scary feeling. It's just, it's really scary. Wow, Can imagine. They don't believe the shooting. Imagine yeah. how refreshing that what would be trying to say? from some sun what? people. Yeah. There's more drugs Dude. over here, so there needs to be more what police. Trying to say it? Nah, what he's he trying to say is Lawrence is basically Lawrence is a spot where everybody come to get their drugs because that's the spot where all Dominicans have all the heroin and all the fentanyl shit going on. So uh, yeah, all well, those all those spots that he said, more police, right? all those spot, yeah, but all those spots he was talking about were like little suburban spots, like all the white towns. Oh, okay. He's they're coming to they're Lawrence coming there. I see to to get this shit. Yeah, they're coming to get their drugs. That's why it's more police activity going on in Lawrence. But he's bullshitting. There always been police activity because Lawrence has always been. It's, it's it's one of the worst places in Massachusetts besides Boston. It's like one of the worst. Is it like Ooh. sun violence, like like random killings for no reason? Yeah, it's all it's, it's it is, but it's mostly like it's more Umbrito shit going on because Umbrito's run that shit up there. Umbrito's well, right, and the, like, um, Cambodians, the Cambodians like and Umbrito's like akin to they... sun violence where innocent people are getting shot and beefs between Umbrito's. Aren't they more apt to use a blade? Well, like, like up there, like up there in those areas, it's like gang shit. So it's like you're gonna have umbritos mixed with the Sun Man, mixed with the Cambodians. It's like one, like a melting pot type shit. It's like, it's like gangs, different. It's a Bloods, Crips, but they be all different nationalities in those, that one gang. Some yeah, of those gangs would be all Cambodian. Pot. Some of those gangs would be, yeah, it's crazy. Some gangs would be all Cambodian. Some would be all Dominicans, or just be all mixing. Into one fucking melts and part type shit. So tell me this. Yeah, it's crazy. So tell me this. These 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 are if I if I'm a son man, right, and I meet a hot um Dominican chick at the fucking mall and she tell and, and I get home and I call her and you know we talking and it's all gravy and I say, Yeah, I wanna come see you and she tell me she live in Lawrence. Am I going to be um, happy to go over there and visit some hot Dominican chick? No, you're not coming there. <laughs> it, 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 it depends on who you know and the neighborhood. I don't know nobody. Like I, don't nice know nobody. I don't know nobody. I don't know nobody. Hell no. Hells no. Fucks no. Don't go. Fucks no. Fucks no. Fucks no. That's like a no-no. Like, you don't know nobody. Hell no. And if you knew somebody. That, that booty call that and seeing your car on blocks first thing in the morning ain't worth it. That yeah, they the least, no that bullshit. The no, no, joking. The no, no, mean, joking. no joking. No joking. No joking. They're taking your car. They take. No joking. They are taking car parts and all that shit. But you ain't going up to Lawrence and just thinking that's gonna be all sweet. Cause them dudes is real. Like they real out there. It's not like some bullshit dudes and shit. These dudes are really into that life and shit. Mm. I ain't trying. I ain't trying to empty them on but it, it, up there yeah, that's they dominate this shit. Yeah. Over here than over there, mm -hmm. so there has to be more police activity. It's it's just you know a scary feeling. It's just it's really scary. Police say they don't believe the shooting to be random. So far, no arrests have been made. Anyone with information is asked to contact police. The shooting remains under investigation. All right, so we got one for the gliders, one for the ombritos, and four for the sons, man. Who gonna win? Break the tie between the gliders and the 